First thing to do is clear out this entire chamber room where the boss fight occurs, and after you've done that, go back around and collect every single coil that you can find, and bring them on back here on where I'm about to show you, right in front of the terminal for the elevator. This is basically where Tremonius is going to start off at the beginning of the boss fight, and you can instantly shoot those coils, blow them up, and completely take down his shields. And then you can basically just kill him. So I'm about to collect all the fusion coils, there should be about 6 or 7, like I said. You can then go and pick up the seed, bring it on back, but do not yet start the elevator. Let's get back to the elevator. You basically just want to make sure that the fusion coils are all close together, otherwise they're not going to have as much of a concentrated impact on Tremonius himself. So that's just, just me correcting them a bit before starting the boss fight. Alright, well now you can just start the boss fight when you feel satisfied with your coil placements. Big note, you do have to be quite quick with this because he's going to instantly fly and jump over at you, so you got to shoot the coils right as he's over them. Like this, there we go. Yeah, now you can just shoot and make sure that if you throw your grenades, they stick right on him, otherwise they do barely any damage. There we go, so you can see me doing tons of damage to him right there, and that's him taken out within the first few seconds of the boss fight. So that's the first method. The second method is a bit easier, it's a bit simpler for those who don't have that good of aim or faster for reaction time. For the second method, you're going to want to take most of your coils, in my case I have five, and bring them to where I'm about to show you. Make sure to leave one coil near the terminal, because we're going to use that one coil to take out the jackals at the very beginning. Alright, this last coil you want to put in this rough spot, we're going to basically shoot it at the beginning to take out the jackals. When you start, you want to bait the jackals to move closer to the coil, take them out, there we go, I got one there. And now you want to move back to your little hidey hole that I showed you, and the whole strategy basically hinges on the fact that you're waiting for them to come to you. And this might take you 2 minutes, 5 minutes, this took me 10 minutes because of how long the AI took to get down here, but yeah, basically you're going to throw the coil, throw your grenades and shoot them. Make sure to aim a little lower, because you do throw higher than you cross here. So first have the jackal come to me, just throw your coil, pretty simple, and now you want to take your next coil and wait for Tremonis to come by. So now I have Tremonius come by, I'm waiting to throw my coil, aiming a little bit lower than I should. There we go. And then you want to throw your grenades, and as I said earlier, make sure they actually stick to him so they do tons of damage. If they don't, that's fine, you can throw other coils if you don't have enough grenades. But yeah, this is the second method. Uh, it takes a little bit longer than the first one, but it is much safer. Now you could also do this with a skewer much faster without having to use fusion coils, but if you didn't pick up the skewer, this is your alternative. And with that, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and found this very helpful, and good luck with your legendary walkthrough.